Hi there! In this episode of Reading 101, I'm going to talk about how to maximize the effects created by the Vox Humana and Forte stops. I had mentioned in a previous chapter that I think that these are the most misused and misunderstood effect stops on a reed organ. In most cases, they just change just a few ranks of reeds, or just a portion of just one rank of reed. It's very subtle the change. Let's take a closer look at the Forte and how it works. On this particular organ, the forte only opens one swell that contains the reeds at the back of the cell block only. Although the change isn't very noticeable, it can be used for more than just making things louder. It can also be handy for creating different sounds with the other reeds. If I open the Vox Celeste and the Aeolian, the Vox Celeste will be the primary sound as the Aeolian is naturally softer. When I open the forte, the swell that contains the aeolian is opened, but I'll keep the knee swell for the vox celeste closed, which now reverses the primary sound to the aeolian. If you have a reed organ with this kind of arrangement, you will have to understand and know where the ranks of reeds are located and which swell cover controls them. On common two rank reed organs, like this one, the forte is just a stop knob to open the swells. It does the identical thing to the knee swell lever. It has been described as to enhance and provide full tone. However, if you have the knee swell open and you pull the forte, what happens? Absolutely nothing. If you have the forte open and you open the knee lever, it will have the exact same effect. Nothing. On smaller organs, the forte will do two things. One is to give your knee a break from using the knee swell in order to easily keep the organ evenly loud. And the second, which applies to larger organs too, is to enhance the Vox Humana. On many North American reed organs, the most common tremulant is called the Vox Humana. This effect stop provides a subtle tremolo that only works for the rear sets of reeds on the treble side by using a rotating fan that reflects the sound. When the Vox Humana is opened, in order to maximize the effect, either a set of reeds that are not in the swell box, or the swell should be opened. Here's your opportunity to use the forte. When the swell is closed, the sound of the reeds is dissipated into the soundboard and within the swell. This will still work, but when the swell is opened, the sound of the reeds are more directed towards the fan, and the sound is reflected for more of a tremolo effect. This tremolo is most pronounced when a single solo stop is used and a single note is played, accompanied by something soft in the bass. The more notes you add to the solo stop, the harder it is to hear the effect. If you have all stops open, including the Vox Humana, all it does is takes more air and it does nothing to the sound at all. The Vox Humana will have little to no effect at all on the reed cells at the front of the reed cell block. When you add these front reeds to the reeds at the back, it will only hide the effect. To find which reeds are affected by the Vox Humana, open the forte and try one stop at a time in the treble and play a C scale in the center of the treble. Listen closely. Some Vox Humana stops on certain organs are fairly quiet. Once you find which ones are most affected by the Vox Humana effect, Either make notes or better yet, memorize the stops and the read locations. The better you know your read organ, the more successful you will be at creating a multitude of different voices and colors. There is another type of tremulant other than the Vox Humana that has a stop name of tremolo or tremulant. This was an older technology, what many call a beater bar. The effect of this type is very pronounced, as in this video by Michael Hendren. There are some limitations to what music you apply this stop to, as sometimes this tremolo will be too overpowering. But with the right piece, like this one, the effect can be quite unique and beautiful.
On the next episode of Reading 101, I would like to take you with me on a road trip to the Lee Conklin Reed Organ Museum in Hanover, Michigan to see the wonderful collection of instruments they have there. Until then, be creative, make music, and have fun. Thanks for watching. <laughs>